Hey guys, Enter the Stars, Antonin Scalia, died on the first day of Looper Kalia. The 44th day of the year, February 13th, and the first day of Looper Kalia. Scalia died. You think this does not have significance? This is the matrix that we live in, you guys. This is the honeycomb matrix. And when you rotate the honeycomb hexagon cube, it forms the star of David, the seal of Saturn, which manages this reality. This is Scalia, and he is dead on the 44th day of the year under the 44th president at 79 years old and 79 is the 22nd prime number and 22 years after 1979 we had 9-11 now what was his most notable case his most notable case was Planned Parenthood versus Casey in 1992. Planned Parenthood versus Casey in 1992. Now, this individual, Robert Casey, was battling in a conservative approach to maintain some of the provisions to make it harder for women to get an abortion. From what I could gather from this. Now, Robert Casey had some issues with his identity being stolen. And during his campaigns, he had three of uh, two of his campaigns stolen because of identity. And people voted for the wrong Casey. I thought this was interesting because my name is Casey. Casey isn't Casey was the campaign slogan. And will the real Casey please stand up? Interesting times back in 19, the 1980s. This is Robert Casey. Now, as I said, the synchronicities of this matrix go on and on and on. And there is no mistake that he was found dead on Lupercalia, the first day of Lupercalia, and that the last letters of his name are Calia as well. So, since he died on Lupercalia, I thought I would do a search on the wolf and Scalia. And in his own words, he says, but this wolf comes as a wolf Unbelievable. So for those of you that think this Lupercalia thing is just a myth, or that I'm crazy, or how could one man know all these things, here is your proof, and it will keep coming and coming and coming until God reveals to you the truth about the reality that we live in. Take care and be safe, you guys.